So I'm back with another tactic for the tactic testing league. The tactic we're testing out today is Spielmacher. It's version two of it. It's free at the back. It's attacking now, so hopefully we're going to score some goals. When you got Haaland up front, I'm sure we will. What do we do here? We choose three teams. Man City, season preview to finish first. West Ham, season preview to finish 10th. And then Nottingham Forest, season preview to finish 20th. We leave the assistant manager in charge. He has to play this tactic. And then we'd have all the points at the end of the season, how well three teams are done. Then we put it in a fun tactic testing league table at the end. If you want to download this tactic, it will be in the description below. The link will be for this tactic. But if you can't download it for any reason, Follow what I'm going to show you now. So in goal, we have a sweeper, keeper on support. There is some add-on instructions. I never mention them, but pause it when need be because you will need to add them on to copy this tactic. And then on the left-hand side of the back three, we have a ball playing defender on defend. And then we have a ball playing defender on cover with different instructions. And then on the right-hand side, we have a ball playing defender on defend. On the left-hand side, we've got a wing-back attack. We've got a Roman playmaker on support. We've got an anchor on defend. And then we have a wing back attack on the right hand side. We've got a shadow striker attack. Mark specific position. Who's he marking? The defensive midfielder. And then on the left hand side we've got advanced forward attack. Mark specific position again. Who's he marking? The right hand side central defender. And then on the right hand side advanced forward attack. And it's again mark specific position. And I imagine he's marking this, yeah, the left hand side of the back two. And then a customer style is a tactical one. Uh, technical style is a custom one, should I say. Mentality is attacking. In possession, what have we got? We've got attacking with fairly wide. We've got player defence. Focus to play down the left. Focus to play down the right. Overlap on the left. Overlap on the right. Passing direct is much shorter. Tempo higher. Time wasting never. Whip crosses. Work the ball into the box. And that seems to be about it. In transition, what do we have? Counter press. Counter. Slow the pace down. So speak to centre backs. Roll it out. Out of possession, what do we have? High press, standard defensive line, trigger press much more often, prevent short goal kick distribution, and stop crosses. That is it. Like I said, I mentioned what we do here. Three teams, May City, West Ham, and Nottingham Forest. So now, let's get straight to results. So we're going to start with the Community Shield and the Carabao Cup. But sadly, they lost both. Liverpool in the Community Shield on penalties. Extra time in the Carabao Cup final against Man United. But they did beat Brentford along the way. Leicester and Liverpool just about on penalties. And Fulham in the FA Cup. They got to the quarterfinals and lost against Liverpool 1-0. Not great so far. Beat Leicester. Beat Fulham. Beat Cheltenham along the way. In the Champions League group stages. They finished on 15 points. They did lose one game against Olympiagos. A little bit of a tough group I think. It's not too bad at all. We look how they got later on in the last 16. They just scraped through against Celtic and then lost against AC Milan. Just, just, it's very close. But in the league, they are champions with 83 points. A gold of 57. They lost five, drew eight, won 25, a 5 1 against Leicester, 2 1 against Man United, 3 2 against Arsenal, 5 0 against Brighton, 4 0 against Wolves. Some good results there. And this, I imagine, will always be the same. Haaland is the top goal scorer in the league. 39 goals. Is there anyone else? No, not from Man City. Uh, Harlan with a 7.88. Gomez with 21 assists. That's really good. And he looks like a cracking player. Uh, what else do we have? Harlan, most man in the matches, clean sheets. What do we have? Fourth place, Edison with 14 clean sheets. And then Laporte there with 12 yellow cards. If I look at the team overall view, what do we have? Most points per game, a 2.18. Most goals, second place with 94. Most shots for 739. Fewer shots against second place, 309. Best pass completion in fourth place, 87%. Most possession, top, 62%. Most tackles won. It's good to be top on most possession for a change. Most tackles won, not on there. Most dribbles made, not on there. Most clean sheets, joint fourth place of 14. Fewest conceded, joint third place, conceding 37 not too bad. Not too bad. They didn't win. Well, they won the Premier League. But other than that, no. In the Cups was no. 83 points. It's not too bad. Really needs to be in the 90s if it really wants to compete with the top tactics. But now, let's test it out of West Ham. So in the Carabao Cup, they got to the final. Lost 2-0 against Chelsea. Beat Watford along the way. Beat Liverpool along the way. 3-1. Derby and Bournemouth in the FA Cup. They got knocked out in the third round against Derby 2-1. In Europa Conference League group stages, 
They topped their group with 13 points. They lost one, drew one, won four. Not bad at all. How about they get later on? In the last 16, they beat Slavia Prague. They beat Villarreal in the quarter final. And then in the semi final, had Fiorentina. Beat them 3 1 at home, but lost 3 0 away from home. And that's as far as they got in the league. Third place, Champions League football next season 68 points. Golden to 23. Lost 12. Drew 5, 121. Not bad at all. If I'm going to pick up some results. 3 0 against Tottenham. Yeah. 5 0 against Nottingham Forest. And that's about it. The Tottenham one really upset me. Uh, we've got, got most goals. Fourth place, Shamaka. Uh, Skamaka comes in with 20 goals. A giant bone with 17 and another guy with 10 goals. So, unlike Man City, they are sharing the goals about. And Skamaka with a 7.42 in the top three average ratings. Is there anyone else we have a look? There is. Famanaski's on there. So, they got a few. Zoom is down the bottom there. So, they got a few players on the top 20 list as well. Clean sheets, what do we have? Seven apiece. That's not bad. So, really. That's, full, that's 14 clean sheets, I would say. It is 14 clean sheets. I can do the math. 7 and 7. Uh, second place, most share cards with 13. Team overview, what do we have? Most points, we got a 1.79. Most goals, third place with 69. Most shots for, fourth place with 534. Fewer shots against, seventh place with 459. Best pass completion, seventh place with 85%. It's nice getting on the list. And then most possession, third place with 57%. Most tackles, one, fifth place with 827. Most dribbles made, no. Most clean sheets, 14. We've done the maths earlier. Fewest conceded, conceded 46 goals in a uh, joint seventh place. Not too bad at all. Got to the final of the Caraba Cup. Got to the semi-final of Europa Conference League. That's not bad at all. And third place in the league. 68 points is good, but it still feels a little bit low. It does still feel a little bit low. Now, let's test out with Nottingham Forest. In the Carabao Cup, they went out in the second round against Leeds. In the FA Cup, they went out in the third round against Man United, losing 4-0. It's not looking great. It doesn't get any better. In the league, 17th, they avoided relegation, which is the main thing. Their season preview to finish 20th. 17th, 39 points, minus 32 goal difference. Lost 23, drew 3, won 12. If I pick up some results, 4-0 against Chelsea, 3-0 against Everton, 3-0 against Fulham, 2-1 against Crystal Palace. So there is some really good results. Haaland again is the top goal scorer. Do we have anyone on there? Uh, Johnson's on there with 17 goals, 15 goals. So you are still scoring a lot of goals. That's 32 goals for the pair. Average rating-wise, what do we have? No one. Uh, player of the match was no one in there. Clean sheets, what do we have? We're down the bottom. Henderson, five clean sheets. Uh, no one in the top three. Southampton have been a little bit dirty. No assists in the top three. But team overall view. Most points per game, we're not going to be on there. Most goals, eighth place, 54 goals. Most shots for, fewer shots against. Best pass completion. Most possession, we are on this one. Sixth place with 54%. Loads of possession, but they couldn't do anything with the ball. Most tackles won, no. Most draws made, no. Most clean sheets, fewest conceded. Let's just go to the competition screen. So got knocked out early in both cups and finished, let me wait a minute, one sec, 17th in the league. It's not bad at all. Like I say, not in a forest, season preview finished 20th. So they avoided relegation. That is the good thing by five points. Let me add up all these points and then put it in a fun tactic testing league table that's just coming up next. Spielmacher version two comes in at number third spot on the table. 158, drew 16, lost 40, a goal difference of 48, and a points to of 190. Some really good pass completion and some really good possession. Just needs a little tweak for it to be a fantastic tactic. It's a great tactic, but be fantastic. Just needs a little tweak. Um, a very good tactic, like I said. If you like a bit of Wonder Kids, experiment, some other tactic testing videos, hopefully I've got it all for you on the channel. Just for me to say now, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.